Here are some of the cool features of Brackets Code Editor that will make your coding life a lot more easier than before. So without getting late, let's get started. Now first of all, I want you to download an extension called Emmet. If you already have it, then it's well and good. If you haven't, you can do that by simply going to Extension Manager and then install it. I have already installed this on my PC so I don't have to. Now let's see what Emmet can do for you. Write doc and then hit the tab key and it will automatically generate the template for an HTML document. Cool right? Again with Emmet you can assign a class to an HTML tag like this and an ID selector like this. Cool let's move on. If you want to copy and paste a particular line at the same time instead of following Ctrl C and Ctrl V we can do it by pressing Ctrl plus D and paste it as many times as you want. Great right? Let's see the next one. Let's say I want to move that line number 16 to line number 8. So is there any particular method for it? Oh yes there is. Just hold Ctrl plus Shift and then press the up arrow key to move it upward and down arrow key to move it downward. Cool, let's see the next one. Now suppose you have changed your mind and you want to change the name of those ABC classes. You might be wondering if you could do this in one go. Well, you could do this with the help of multiple cursor and find and replace. Just press and hold the control key and then click on anywhere where you want to generate a cursor. Secondly, to enable find and replace, press Ctrl plus H and then replace it. You can manually replace it by one by one or you can replace them all at the same time. Alright, let's move on. Now this one is my favorite. This is the coolest feature that I have found on brackets. You can write CSS codes without opening CSS file. Okay, let me demonstrate it. Let's say I want to apply some CSS to this ABC class selector. Just move your cursor over there and press Ctrl plus E and boom. And then select new rule and then the CSS file. For my case, I have style.css linked here so I'm gonna choose this one and let's apply some CSS rules let's say height 40 pixel and width 20 pixel okay cool you can also apply on the diff tag like this Okay, let's see the last one. This is Quick Docs. Quick Docs is like a brief documentation for a particular HTML tag or CSS property. You can open Quick Docs by pressing Ctrl plus K. Now let's open the Quick Docs for body tag. Take your cursor over there and press Ctrl plus K. And let's see yeah it opened a documentation a brief definition about a body tag and read more on Mozilla documentation like this now let's see for our width tag 